in this question we have been told that two cyclists starting at the same place are moving towards the same campground by different routes so the first cyclist moves 1110 meters to you east so 1110 10 meters due east then he moves towards the north another 1510 meters so another displacement of 1510 meters then he reached the campground the second cyclist starts out by heading due north for 1810 meters so he moves 1810 meters to the north uh, then he turns towards the campground so and heads directly towards it so after this he moves towards the campground and heads directly so he will move in this direction to the campground in part a we need to find out at the turning point how far is the second cyclist from the campground so we need to find out this displacement we will call this x we need to find out this displacement so as you can see that this makes a right angle triangle so this that displacement x and this whole makes a right angle triangle so we are going to draw this uh, triangle separately to find out the displacement x so so the hypotenuse of this triangle is going to be x this is a right angle triangle the base is going to be 1110 meters and the height is going to be 1810 minus 1510 so height is going to be 1810 minus 1510 as you can see from this diagram so this is going to be 300 so 300 meters so now we can find out the value of x using pythagoras theorem so x square equals to 300 square plus 1110 square so the value of x is 1150 meters so this is the answer for part a in part b we need to find out in what direction measured relative to due east must the second cyclist head during the last part of the so we need to find out the direction so this is due east so we need to find it relative to this so we need to find this angle we'll call this angle theta so let us draw it separately so this is a triangle we need to find out this angle theta we know the sides of the triangle this is 1150 this is 1110 and this is 300 so we can find out using trigonometric ratios so this is going to be 1150 cos theta is going to be equal to 1110 so cos theta is going to be the ratio of 1110 divided by 1150 so this is going to cancel out theta is going to be cos inverse by 115 so theta is going to be So the angle is 15.2 degrees so if we draw this is the displacement vector and relative to due east the angle is 15.2 degrees so the, we are moving clockwise so there's going to be a negative sign so the direction is minus 15.2 degrees from east so this is the answer for this question